Today we're out at Lake Arrowhead, impounded in 1966, surface area 14,669 acres, max depth 45 feet. Fish species contain largemouth bass, catfish, crappie, white bass, sunfish, drum, gar, and carp. Alright, today we're going to be fishing on the west side of Lake Arrowhead at a friend's lake house. There is a state park and there is a public boat ramp on the west side of this lake, so it's open to the public at all times. Today we're going to be fishing with minnows. As you see, I got some minnows out. And we're going to be using the bottom walker rig. The bottom walker rig, the weight sets on the bottom and then it that bobber on it floats up and the hooks float set above the bottom. And this rig is really good for catfish. I've caught crappie on it. I've caught bass on it. So this is a really good all around rig that I love to use. All right, now that we got all our poles set up, we're just gonna sit back and wait. So it's about 40 something degrees out here with the wind blowing. It's a nice little cold Texas winter day. <laughs> and we got our first fish hooked on the bottom walker rig with the live minnows that we set up. And this that does have double hooks on it. So let's see what we got, cause it's a pretty good size when we All right, I have a really bad habit of what I'm about to do, and that's pull these fish up by the line. It's not a good thing to do. Make sure you have a net. I should really be using a net right now, but I always tend to forget to grab it. As you see, he's fighting me to get up there. I could have easily lost him just now, and he could have slipped off that hook because I didn't have the proper equipment, or I didn't get the proper equipment to do that. All right guys, as you see, we got this thing up on the dock and Jethro here, my little puppy. He's about seven, eight months old. He'll be in the more videos with us because he'll be going out a lot more this year with us. But he's checking out this cat too. It ended up being a pretty good sized blue cat that you're about to see. He ended up weighing nine and a half pounds and I forget how long he was, but we're gonna toss this bottom walker rig back out. We got it re-lined up and hooked up and Get it tossed back out and see if we can catch another one that size or a little bit bigger. Maybe we can get one bigger than that. So, see what happens. I turn my back for a few seconds and this guy's on the sleeping bag with the fish covered up. I guess he, guess he thinks his fish is cold. <laughs> Goofy little puppy. But yeah, he's still a puppy, so he's still learning. So he's gonna get used to this and be a real good dog for that. As you see, this fish is a pretty good sized guy, flopping around like that, being goofy. Guys, we just took this another one here and this one seems like it's another pretty good size one now on this pole we had a live sunfish on it on a slip weight rig sitting on the bottom so we're about to see what we pull in and this fish seems pretty good size so hopefully it's another good size blue cat Sure enough guys, we got us another blue cat right here. This one's pretty good size too. Once again, here I go doing that bad habit of grabbing these fish and holding it by the line. I'm surprised I have not lost these two big fish today because I'm doing that, but try to make sure y'all use a net. Don't follow my bad habits. <laughs> All 
Alright guys, as you see, this is a pretty good sized blue cat. He ended up weighing eight and a half pounds. And so we're going to get another sunfish back on this pole and get it back out in the water and see what else we can catch. See if we can bring some more of these blues in today. Alright, as you see, I have these fish on a stringer that I caught today. And that's because I'm going to take these guys home and I'm going to clean them. And I'm going to end up cooking them because I love to have fish fries for me and my friends because they love to catch the fish I eat. You know, we're from Texas, so we love our fried catfish. So, but these two are all going to run and catch today. We're going to pack it on up and head on in because me and the dog are a little, got a little chilly. So, but we're going to fish Lake Arrowhead again. We're going to do the state park. We're going to do the west side where the public boat ramp is. So y'all can check out the other places that y'all will be able to actually get to. So I hope y'all enjoyed this and I'll see y'all next time. Thank you.